What's going on, my YouTubers? It is your boy Ghostface Gaming. Back once again. It's a sad day in Columbia. Um, I'm gonna put this up under Ghostface Speaks or the Mind in the Mind of Ghostface, or I can't even really think about what I got a title right now. Um, but yeah, so uh, we have an issue we need to talk about, man. Um, the the thumbnail you see right here is of Amaria Watson and her mother they have been missing since January 31st Amaria's dad uh, it was a custody you know visitation going on and the dad hadn't seen her since the 31st and she was supposed to return on the second and she hasn't been seen yet warrants have been issued for the mother's arrest I forgot the mother's name, but I surely will add it in here somewhere. I want to say the mother's name is Tanisha. But warrants have been issued for her arrest, and she's been missing since the 31st. It was reported on the 2nd. Uh, the brother says he knows the whereabouts of them, but he's not releasing the info. We also have missing here in Columbia, South Carolina, little Faye Sweatley six-year-old little girl from Red Bank um she got out of school Monday got off the bus around 245 she was reported missing around three o'clock it's a lot that's wrong with this story it's a lot that's wrong with the situation as of right now they still haven't found Faye or Maria the feds have got involved in Faye's Search. We have about 250 officers around the city looking for Faye. We have the feds involved. And uh, this is not confirmed, so I don't want any flack or bullshit from you people. It's not confirmed, but the parents have been taken into custody, mother and the boyfriend. Um, WLTX sister station went to North Carolina to talk to the father and they had seen her since Christmas little Faye and they was hoping to see her this weekend so we have all these uh because I'm finna get to the meat of it here's where we get ready to get to the meat we have all these uh cameras just about everybody not everybody but just about everybody in that neighborhood has a ring doorbell which you know with ring doorbells they have cameras on it there's a camera of little Faye getting off the bus. And then she was playing in the yard and she came up missing. Now, within the search for this little girl, it's only been a mile radius. They don't see any signs of abduction and the parents are cooperating to the best of their ability. But here's where we get ready to get into the point of it. Or the point I'm trying to make. Because there were some debates. I made a post. There were some debates about it. Excuse my background. But there were some debates about it in the post that I made. And so I made a follow-up post. And it was even more debates. Which shows me the ignorance of the people. It really shows me the ignorance of the people. So, Faye has been missing, as of the time of recording this video, 48 hours. So you have 250 officers, you have the federal investigators involved, now you have condemned, see they said this in a news report and nobody actually picked up on the verbiage of the words, you have cadaver dogs out here looking for her now, the parents cars have been taken into, and been told taken into custody, and now you're questioning the parents, so if there's no signs of abduction and you're using all of these resources to find this child, yet you're not going outside of a mile radius. You just expanded your search. To me, that sounds like you're looking for a body. To me, that sounds like you're looking for a body. And people have an issue like, oh, but this little girl could be dead. Well, guess what? Amaria has been missing two weeks now. Her and her mother. It doesn't matter whether it was a custody battle or not. And oh, she's with her mother. So it's fine. Well, guess what? This is the state of South Carolina, folks. In the state of South Carolina, the mother doesn't really lose custody of her child unless it's a really serious situation. Am I reaching? 
Am I reaching? Or are you reaching? Or are you not paying attention to context clues? It's not really... You don't get your child taken away from you in South Carolina as a mother unless it's some dire circumstances. This child and her mother has been missing for two weeks and somebody knows where the whereabouts are and they're not telling. And so you mean to tell me he's not in custody? So you mean to tell me that Faye has only been missing 48 hours up until this date and we have the feds and everything involved looking for this child but we have a mother and child missing and not that same amount of energy has been put into the search for them it doesn't matter about the fucking color bruh we have children missing six year old and a ten year old so drop the color shit I want just as much energy put into all our missing children if you can put if you can shut down the interstate for drug dealers get your dogs get your helicopters get your task force for drug dealers i want this same amount of energy used for all cases for all cases i want this same amount of energy used for all cases if we're looking for children and you're using my tax paying dollars then it needs to be used for all cases like at the little girl phase school my wife was a substitute teacher there she was there with the day the little girl got missing she got a message today saying that they pretty much have canceled all outside substitute teachers coming to the school you know what I'm saying? So they try to handle this in-house. They try to keep all outsiders away from this as much as possible. And I really pray for little Faye's family. So don't get it twisted like, oh, you just saying that because ain't nobody speaking on the black girl. Nigga, it doesn't matter black or white. These are children that these are our children. If you people do not understand what's going on here, please pay attention to the motherfucking narrative, bro. No excuse for the language. Please pay attention to the motherfucking narrative. Okay? It doesn't matter that she's with her biological mother. Her father had custody. If you ain't take the narrative, they'll kill the parent, take the child. Use that same energy for all our children if you're going to look for them. Not just one special case. We got ourselves a new job in a we got ourselves a new John Benet Ramsey because this is already and hit CNN. It's going national. We, like I said, we got the feds involved, man. Listen, somebody call Olivia Benson, Ice T, and Elliot to come wrap this goddamn case up by Friday, man. Because for the amount of money that you're spending, taxpaying dollars, and the amount of resources that you're using. Man, this is going to be a lifetime special, an episode of SVU, a book, and this is our new John Bernay Ramsey. I need the same amount of energy used for all our children. If all our children are missing, use that same amount of energy to find them all instead of the drugs. Because that's what's going to take our country into the next generation. That is the future we need to protect. Cut the bullshit, folks.